Today's the big day, so the sun has risen here in Vegas now. Once you actually see what's in store, though, you might not be quite so excited. Whoa! I feel so excited. Darren, are you ready? Wow. <laughs> okay, so we appear to be at some sort of an airport. You ready, guys? Yeah. I'm actually ready. This is that side of your car. Here you go. Lost track of the forest through the trees, forgot what I was chasing. Spent so many nights living out at sea that my heart is gone vacant. And everybody who was close to me all stayed on dry land. Now I'm driving back on in the state west. I just gotta feel something. Not gonna wait till the morning. Because something's gonna change my mind. I don't wanna change my mind. Oh, I wanna stay right here, right here. Like, I'm speechless. That was so beautiful. Yeah, it was. Guys, are you wondering what's going on right now? What has Darren, the wedding planner, done? <laughs> on the wedding planner, yeah. Darren planned all of this. So you probably thought that we were going to get married in Las Vegas, probably in a chapel. Well, you were wrong. We're actually not even in Nevada anymore. We're actually in Arizona, and um, we're in the Grand Canyon. Yeah. Literally and feels like... just woken up. Hello, did Canyon. you enjoy that? You went to sleep, didn't you? <laughs> when the Grand Canyon, Karma. Wow. Can you believe it? This reminds me of like films I've seen, like it was amazing. country and western films. That one like, bit hey, where we just like dipped over the edge though, and then suddenly it done that bit. You know, like when you go over a bridge yeah. in a car, but it was like going over a thousand bridges like at once. Ride. Yeah. You know yeah. when it goes up slowly and then it goes down. Yeah, that was terrifying. Throw, like completely you down but it was scary <laughs> can you believe that i'm in the middle of the desert in this wedding dress <laughs> this is absolutely crazy wow but this is the beast that took us here and we've even brought our wedding cake with us guys oh my goodness i am glammed up in the middle of the grand canyon this is crazy oh look at me and sienna over there just sitting looking out that is so cute what on earth is going on mate Amazing. This is the most beautiful, magical place Thanks, ever. Chopper. I know. I've always wanted to come here. Thank you. It's the best thing ever. Yeah. Isn't it karma? <laughs> we had one little accident. One rose has came out, but you can't really tell, can you? And apparently the cake is like toppled over, but it's still going to taste nice. Should we get married then? Yeah, we are. Shall we? Yeah, of course. Come on then. Have you got the rings? Uh, yeah, they're in my backpack. Okay. Oh, do you know what? I was going to leave the backpack there. It's lucky I didn't, isn't it? What? Oh my goodness. <laughs> we need the rings. But this is amazing. So I'm going to keep saying it over and over for fam. But this is epic. Oh, the cake actually looks okay because it's been toppled over. Well, All right, okay. We've had a little bit. Same. That was actually, we can blame it on Sienna. Sienna, have you been eating the cake? But look how beautiful it looks. This is a vegan cake made by, who is it made by, Darren? I've got, sorry. Vegan babe. Vegan babe in Las yeah. Vegas and she makes the most beautiful vegan cakes and we found her and um, they were, oh, she's done an amazing job. Obviously yeah. we've got to try it, but I know it's going to be nice. There's three different flavors in there as well. I think we've got like Mexican mocha and then we've got like a vanilla and berry 
berry one and then there's like um, a chocolate peanut, peanut butter. butter. Basically, I want a three layers. The top layer is gonna be like coffee flavor because Darren loves coffee cake, but they've got Mexican mocha, which is like sounds even better. And then the girls have peanut butter and chocolate. Yeah. So the middle section is for the girls. And then the base one is just like a traditional like vanilla -y birthday cake style one because Karma can eat that as well. I think it's now actually happening. I think they're actually getting married, yeah. but I just like, please, yeah, sure. I can't believe what's happening. Karma is so like, ad like she's so like moody in the, in the limo, isn't she? <laughs> yeah. And, and then it's like she had a nap, but she needed another one. But then she snapped in the helicopter and now she's really chill. But yeah. I was really well, worried if it's found out she'd be crying down the ceremony. Like we're not going to get married by the way. I don't, <laughs> don't know. But she's really Just chill every day. It's worked out really well, hasn't it? It's going to be really awkward if you guys decide not to do it. Can we say no as a joke? We might do a long pause just, just for Can a laugh. Can we do that for like the fun bit? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Darren and Georgie, congratulations, first of all, on uh, this amazing day, your beautiful family, and welcome off to this fabulous chapel. Thank you. Thank you. So we've come together here today to celebrate one of the greatest moments in life, and it's the joining of two hands and two hearts in marriage. Out of the routine of ordinary life, something extraordinary happened, even though it was nine years ago. <laughs> you met, you fell, you fell in love with each other. In marriage, it's the little things that are the big things, like never being too old to hold hands. Always remember to say I love you at least once a day. Love is a common search for the good and the beautiful. And uh, one of the most important things that I want you to remember is that it's not just all about marrying the right person, uh, it's also being the right partner to one another in this relationship. I, Darren, take you, Georgie, to be my wife. I, Darren, take you, Georgie, to be my wife. My partner in life. My partner in life. And my one true love. And my one true love. I will cherish our friendship. I will cherish our friendship. And love you today, tomorrow, and forever. I will trust and honor you. I will trust and honor you. Laugh and cry with you. Through the best and the worst. Through the best and the worst. Difficult and easy. Difficult and easy. Whatever may come. I will always be there. I will always be there. And as I give you my hand to hold. And as I give you my hand to hold. I also give you my life to keep. I also give you my life to keep. I, Georgie, take you, Darren, to be my husband. I, Georgie, take you, down to be my husband. My partner in life. My partner in life. And my one true love. My one true love. I will cherish our friendship. I will cherish our friendship. And love you today, tomorrow, and forever. I love you today, tomorrow, and forever. I will trust and honour you. I will trust and honour you. Laugh and cry with you. Laugh and cry with you. Through the best and the worst. Through the best and the worst. Difficult and easy. Difficult and easy. Whatever may come. Whatever may come. I will always be there. I will always be there. And as I give you my hand to hold. As I give you my hand to hold. I also give you my life to keep. I always give you my life to keep. So I'm going to ask that you always treat yourself and each other with respect. And remind yourself of what brought you out here today. Give the highest priority to the tenderness and the gentleness and the kindness that your marriage deserves. So that when frustration and difficulty enters into your marriage like it does every relationship once in a while. You can focus on the things that are right between you. Darren, do you take Georgie to be your wife? I do. <laughs> do you promise to love and honor, cherish and protect her, forsaking all others and holding only to her forevermore? Yes, I do. Georgie, do you take Darren to be your husband? I do. Do you promise to love and honor, cherish and protect him, forsaking all others and holding only to him forevermore? Yes. I, Darren, take you, Georgie, to be my wife. I, Darren, take you, Georgie, to be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. For richer or poorer. For richer or poorer. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. And I promise my love to you. And I promise my love to you. I, Georgie, take you down to be my husband. I, Georgie, take you down to be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. For richer or poorer. For richer and poorer. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. And I promise my love to you. And I promise my love to you. It's going to take trust to know that in your hearts you truly want what's best for each other. It's going to take dedication to stay open to one another and learning to grow together. It's going to take faith to go forward together without knowing exactly what the future holds. 
And it's going to take commitment to hold true to the journey that you're starting here today. So now, without any further ado, it is my pleasure and my honor with the power that's vested in me by the state of Nevada, if you guys are ready for it, I now pronounce your husband and wife. You may kiss your beautiful wife. Wow. Congratulations, guys. <laughs> oh, well done, girls. <laughs> Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, welcome, you. Yeah. What a place to do it. <laughs> See the good side. Yeah, you know it looks amazing. It's so I know. Good. If you're going in at the bottom, the whole thing's gonna collapse. Yeah. Isn't it? <laughs> this is like playing Jenga. Like you yeah. don't go in at the bottom and then just let all the top ones fall. Have I got a cake around my mouth, guys? I hope not. Well, something happened with the cake. I decided to cut from the bottom and it started sliding off and nearly broke. So, um, but luckily we've like put it back in the box and we're now gonna be up back in the helicopter again, Something heading back to Las Vegas. But yes, guys, I just thought I'd tell you about that as I made the You're most- Telling me you broke the cake, yeah? Yeah, <laughs> well, I cut from the bottom. Yeah. Like, why did that not like occur to me? That'd be the most <laughs> stupid thing ever. Little calm, you had a little bit, didn't you? You had the berry filling, was that nice? Oh, I'll finish, I'm gonna take yeah. This so now we're gonna go back up and I'm gonna tell the love doctor, can we please do some of those scary little moves again? <laughs> No. That was so fun. Please, can you make it go no. up and down more no. this time, please? No. Please. <laughs> it was so much yeah. fun. No. It was exciting. No. <laughs> I think you've done really well going in the helicopter, yeah. Darren, because you've been quite nervous for it, haven't you? Yeah, I mean, it was like my idea initially. I just wanted to do something. So I knew it'd add to the emotion where there's like an element of fear as well. And then it's like, yeah, yeah and then it just brings it all together. Well, it was very emotional, it wasn't it? Yeah. yeah, a little scene as usual. You cried at your wedding. Uh -huh. You love crying at weddings, don't you? We all have yeah. a therapy session as well, didn't know, we? Thanks, guys. You Thank you. for a therapy session at the same time. Well, me, I mean, you're, you're not really a teenager that doesn't really like to show emotion too much. Yeah. You're just crying, I right? say. So, oh, it's really yeah. sweet. It's really sweet that everyone was really moved. Fight, I know. You're, Darren is officially your stepdad now, <laughs> yeah. isn't he? I've always been like mum's boyfriend. That just sounds a bit weird. I was like, now I can actually say stepdad and yeah. be like... Official. I know. So it's really nice now to say husband. That sounds a bit... Oh no. Oh my goodness. Um, can you take the camera, Sienna? Oh, yeah. Look, I'm in the middle of the Grand Canyon surrounded by cactuses. I'm going to go through a mini tour of the helicopter so you get to know what we were in. <gasps> I didn't get to see the front, but now I'm seeing it. Look at the front. Okay. Stop trying to fly the helicopter off. Come I'm on. not. I'm showing the fish from the front. Everyone ready? Sorry, yeah, <laughs> we're ready. Back up again. Yeah. as well didn't you? I don't know if you can see the ring this far but with my engagement ring they look beautiful together don't they? Yeah. Thank you! Bye! Oh that was good wasn't it? <laughs> yeah that was so much fun. Back in the limo. Oh wow. Yay. Here we go. Wow. Having a little party now. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Woo! 
did just get married actually. So. Yeah. We did. All right, bye everyone. Thank you very much. Bye. Take care. She was a lovely minister. Yeah. I'm really pleased she married us. She, she was, was amazing. She's so, such a people person, really kind and actual like, like it didn't feel like she was going through the motions with us. It felt like every no. word she met, so kind and she helped organise this with you, didn't she, Darren? Yeah. Like we asked about the cake and the bouquets and she made it happen. Yeah, so. it's amazing. Meet really nice people. The next part, we're now <laughs> going to go do a photo shoot. No, we found some holders. <laughs> for our flowers. Oh yay. That was one of the most magical, I know it's gonna sound cliche, magical and most romantic days of my life. It was so beautiful. Yeah, I feel like we all got to connect Hi. with each other even more so. Like you know when Karma was born, that was a lovely bonding experience. I felt like that was as well. It was amazing guys. So Darren proposed to me at Mount Vesuvius and then we got married in the Grand Canyon. How beautiful. Some of you guys were like, I always thought that you would get married somewhere in nature because you thought that we went to that Vegas so we kind of combine the craziness of Las Vegas with the nature and the beauty of the Grand Canyon so yeah. what a love thank you Darren that, no, Darren planned this amazing. this is his idea I don't know if you guys saw Sienna crying again that was beautiful little karma loved it it's such a beautiful time I nearly broke the cake so we're now going to be going on a two-hour photo shoot all around Vegas you can, like I said you can be able to check those out on our Instagram hopefully we'll get some pics under the sign and maybe with that naked man if I'm lucky <laughs> hopefully thank you so much Fit Fab for being there for us for all your kind wishes here on YouTube and on Instagram like you've all been looking forward to this day. Cheers. Thank you. You're a part of our family. You've followed us on this journey. I know I'm giving you a bit of a sappy ending to the video, but thank you so much, guys. We love you, and we've got more videos to come as a married couple. Yeah, That's he's my husband amazing. now. I love you, Darren. Thank you, and we love you as well, Fizz Fab. See you in our next video. Treasure others for yourself. Mm -hmm.